Well, a man suspected of causing a crash that killed two children in Concord is now under arrest. Witnesses say the suspect was bleeding when he ran away from the scene at Highway 4 in Solano Way last night. KPX 5 reporter Don Lynn is there now with the latest. Da? The scene is all cleaned up now, Brian, but the accident happened right here on this freeway on ramp behind this fence. The force of that crash was so severe, it sent one of the cars flying into this parking lot here. And that car ended up landing right there by the fire hydrant. A CHP helicopter hovered over the crime scene to search for a hit and run driver. He ditched his infinity after he crashed into this Durango SUV. Inside the SUV was a mother and her three kids. CHP investigators say the force of the collision ejected a five year old boy and a 10 year old boy, killing them. The 35 year old mother and a three month old baby strapped in a car seat suffered from major injuries. You could be doing everything right. And some idiot comes down the street not doing everything right and way outside of bounds, and they change your life forever. Investigators say it was just bad luck for the family. Wrong place, wrong time. They say it happened around 11 o'clock last night. The driver of the Infinity was getting off of Highway 4 in Concord, and the family in the SUV was getting onto the freeway. They say the Infinity was going way too fast, couldn't make the turn, slammed into the SUV, and the Infinity went flying into the Kenders parking lot. And there's at least 100 plus feet from the off ramp to where the car came to rest. 10 feet in front of Kinders. So the velocity of that car and the speed had to have been very fast. A number of witnesses inside the restaurant came out and saw the Infinity driver run away. Described him as bloody from the face, from possible lacerations or injuries from the, from the collision itself, and then stumbling upon getting out of the vehicle but immediately fleeing once he exits his Infinity. And that direction was behind us over Highway 4. Police officers arrested the suspect this afternoon. They identified him as 35 year old Lemuel Servan Wilson Jr. It'd be able to run away like that's an actual coward. I mean, you live up to your mistakes. We're told the suspect has a lengthy rap sheet and, of course, is now facing a number of new charges. As for the victims, they're from San Pablo. We don't have the latest conditions on the mother and the baby, but CHP officers say they should survive. Live in Concord, I'm Da Lin, KPIX 5.